Over 12,000 troops paraded in China today to celebrate the 70th anniversary of the end of World War II. The lavish parade also showcased for the first time some of China's new weaponry, such as nuclear-capable ballistic missiles. Attended by over 30 representatives from other countries, including Russia's Vladimir Putin and UN Secretary Ban Ki-moon, it was also the occasion for President Xi Jinping to announce a 300,000 cut in China's troops number. With over 2.3 million members, the China's People's Liberation Army is the world's largest military and its defense budget is the world's second biggest after the US. Xi Jinping said the Chinese army remains committed to peaceful development and will never seek hegemony or expansion. But although it is reducing troops, China is upgrading its naval and air forces and investing in more high-tech military equipment, including stealth fighter jets and boats. The country is currently embroiled in several maritime territory disputes. Several countries, including Japan and the Philippines, have reported Chinese intrusions in their territorial waters. In the past week, the Pentagon confirmed that five Chinese naval vessels were spotted in the Bering Sea between Russia and Alaska during President Obama's visit to the Arctic state. It is believed to be the first time Chinese military boats were spotted in the area. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Dowdy from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.